you are the architect, what we're talking about is you get to architect your life from a totally different perspective. And yet, ironically, it's been there all along. Just like Seal said, it's been there all along. And love will help you know your name. Because at the end of the day, and I want you to future pace this, I want you to fast forward to whatever you think your end's gonna be like, what your funeral will be like. Will people there be talking about all the business dealings that you did, all the houses you bought, all the cars you drove, all the clothes that you designed, or are they gonna talk about your interaction with you? If you've been to one transitional journey, I have yet to hear someone give someone's resume at the end. I've not heard one. I've been to a lot of transitions. I've been to a lot of people transitioning where I've literally held the hand, they've taken the journey and I've seen them leave. I've not heard one person go, dang, I wish I'd bought more companies. I wish I'd been a billionaire 20, 20 times over. I wish I'd finally owned that car, bought this house, slept with that person, done this or done. The only things they always say are the same three. I wish I had done everything I wanted to do. Commonly called regret. Or as we said yesterday, are you gonna allow your music to stay inside of you? Because music and water, that's all that's left. Two, I wish I'd spent more, times with, more time with the loved ones and I've really been with them. My kids, my family, my wife, my husband. And number three, I wish I could do it all over again because I didn't know what I didn't know. That's a When you think of from that perspective, it will allow you to jump into your future and turn around and look backwards to where you are now and see a clear line going, okay, what's really interesting to me right now? What am I really interested in? Because at the end of the day, all those things that everyone done, and I'm not saying that money doesn't allow that experience, but it's really what's on the other side of money. What's on the other side of it? When we focus on the money, we get locked on that, and it becomes a value. The value is not the money, the value is what's on the other side of it, right? So when we start programming ourselves from inside out, you're gonna get really crystal clear that the things that you thought were important are probably gonna slip away, and that's why we start with the guardian because there will be guardians around those things because for up until now, we've protected them. That's why we put a guard there, to make sure that if something threatens that, I'm gonna push it away. Even if I know inside, it's for my best and highest good, this or something better. But I'm not willing to leave that shore because I can't see where that horizon ends.